Welcome to this YouTube class from White Yoga. My name is Juan and I am a teacher at White Yoga and this is Mark. He is also a teacher at White Yoga and the student today. Today I want to use this time to show you a few restorative poses that are going to be amazing to be able to bring you more relaxation into your life. So what the poses that I'm going to show you are going to do is that they're going to activate the parasympathetic nervous system or the part of the nervous system that activates the relaxation response in your body. And a lot of it has to do with having the heart slightly below, or excuse me, the head is slightly, slightly below the heart. So it is a mini inversion. We're going to do about um, a few poses like that. And uh, so I'm going to start um, with uh, Mark lying down on his back. We're going to use today two bolsters. If you don't have bolsters at home, you could also use cushions, maybe harder cushions that you may have on your couch. We're also going to use a strap or a belt if you don't have a strap and two blocks. You could also use books or maybe a harder cushion for the blocks. So Mark, we're going to begin by bringing the pelvis up toward the ceiling and I'm going to slide one of the bolsters or the cushions underneath the pelvis. Then with your belly engaged, bring both knees toward the chest. So this is what I was talking about, which was keeping the heart slightly higher than the head. Knees begin to lengthen so the feet reach up toward the ceiling. And then get a hold of, I'm going to place this strap right here around the arches of the feet. Instead of holding onto the strap with the hands, take your three middle fingers of each hand and then just let them rest inside. Now, these poses are for you to hold between five to 10 minutes at home. Here, we're going to move to the next pose, but you can always pause this video and stay here longer if you like. Then slowly mark, soften the belly, bend your knees, let go of the strap. Now, Mark, bring the feet back down to the floor. Actually, before we do that, can you take the strap, wrap it around the area above the knee joints? And then with the buckle, begin to press. But before you go to full um, bringing the knees toward each other, take your block or a cushion if you have one and bring it underneath. Uh, yeah, you can do that. Yeah, just keeping the block in between the thighs and then take the strap, wrap it around, lower the feet back down to the floor. And option to keep the one block there or lift the pelvis as you slide a second block or bolster or cushion underneath you. Arms can open by your sides. Arms can also rest above the crown of the head, more like a diamond shape. Eyes can be closed. And the beautiful thing about this is that you can relax the legs and the legs won't go anywhere. Keeping the legs into a, a parallel position, softening the toes, and just letting the weight of the body soften down toward the floor. And then for the third pose, so slowly float the eyes open, belly stays engaged, begin to draw the knees. Actually, bring the feet back down. Let's just take one bolster out. So lifting the pelvis up, and I'm actually gonna then bring both knee up, bring the pelvis back down, both knees to your chest, and then take the strap out and take the block out of the legs. Perfect. And then feet back down to the floor, lift the pelvis, slide the other bolster, come down to your pelvis. Now Mark, roll down to one side in a fetal position and then with the top hand, press yourself up to seated. And then coming down onto your hands and knees, bringing the bolster number one underneath you. And then begin to lower the forearms to the floor, keeping the bolster underneath the chest bone and also underneath just the area above the pelvis. Open the arms away. You can also draw the arms further forward if you want. And the crown of the head is slightly down toward the floor. Forehead is resting on your mat. Feel free to turn the head to one side if you like and the other, or the other side. And also allow for the arms to soften completely down to the floor. Mark, bring both legs also a little bit wider away from each other. So this one is beautiful because we have the weight of the, of the back completely melting away from the center. Shoulder blades away from the center and also the head away from the heart. So there is still a little bit of an inversion here of the head below the heart, activating the relaxation response in the nervous system. 
Feel free to stay here for as long as you like, five to 10 minutes. My name is Juan once again, and um, don't forget to visit other videos that we have in our YouTube channel. Thank you so much. Namaste.